If I meet somebody I don't know, but I've learned throughout the years, they ask me what I do for a living. There's a little chuckle at first, and then I'll go, I'm a grave digger. The stories on the headstones is astronomical. There's a, a governors in here, there's mayors in here. Randolph Scott, uh, he's uh, the first American cowboy on TV. Did about 100 movies from 1928 to 1968. Like I could do a whole history tour in just in this round first circle section A, and we, and we would be here for two hours. My name is Bill Bibby, and I am the sexton for the city of Charlotte Cemeteries. The term sexton means the protector of a graveyard came from an old church thing that was brought back. Uh, I manage and run about seven cemeteries and I've been here since 2015. Uh, you have to learn archaeology, you have to learn uh, plumbing, you have to learn buildings, you have to learn roads. There's a whole list of and probably 10% of my job of my job is burying people. That's and it's a it's not that much, but I have to make sure that's the most important job. Gary Frank, who's my mentor still today, he, uh, he came to me, I was coaching his son in baseball, and he goes, I need you to come work for me. And I'm like, what do you do? He worked at a cemetery up in the I'm like, no. I said twice no, then he said, I'll take you to lunch. And I wish I'd have got into it a lot longer than over 20 years ago, yeah. Why I was chosen for my mentor was I was very empathetic understood what other people were going through at that time. So there's many times I'm in front of a family for six hours and they will not remember my name tomorrow because they're, they're in such a cloud at that point in time. I help them through that. And that's the most honorable job that I can have. So the hard part is I'm always happy-go-lucky and in this job you can't always be happy-go-lucky. Uh, during COVID. It was very stressful during that time because we were doubling our, uh, the amount of people we're putting in the ground. So we went from roughly 10 to 17 to about 35 a week. Uh, we would have to be this far away from a family with masks on. And when you're very empathetic and we, I love what I do, it's hard not to hug. You, they want to come and hug you and we have to hold back. So as they're grieving, a hug is always good for during grieving time. We couldn't do that during COVID. So those families are coming back to us now and saying thanks for all what we did. So it's a very rewarding job. Well, it's pretty much in my, to me, this is high priority. So I'd rather preserve it now than have more of a problem later. We have crystal acid we put on it for a stubborn. I'm gonna call this pretty stubborn. And as the days go on, Maybe this morning sun hits it, it'll get shinier every day. Brighter and brighter. The most rewarding part about this job is a hug, believe it or not. Little old lady, it's about 76 years old and just wraps her arms around me and says, Billy, you take care of my husband. And I say, I will. That, those are the ones that grab my heartstring. 